stacking every month. Put that work in, I deserve to stand. Huh. Bring the baddies to the front. This the type of life that I want. Hey. This the type of life that I want. This the type of life that I want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This the type of life that I want. Yo, 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 what up, cool gang? You should play a part of cool gang coming back at you again. Man, sorry for the wait, man. Oh, yeah, well, your boy been busy. Uh, had to work, had to pull some uh, some extra shifts. Had to go to a little, uh, a little, a little Christmas party type deal. You know how that go. But, I'm just playing, I'm just playing, I'm playing, I'm playing with y'all. But, how the heck everybody doing? Man, so we got some some news, man. You know, uh, on Friday, you know, the Marvel Legends team introduced some new stuff. They introduced the uh, 50th anniversary uh, Wolverine. Uh, they released those those things. Um, I'm really excited for the the, the the comic book style Sabretooth. I'm really excited for that. We haven't really got a comic book style Sabretooth. Um, uh, we have had several different style saber tooth but to have a cartoon version of saber tooth i wish they would have gave us that in like a, a deluxe figure style instead of a wolverine two pack now now we did hasbro legends marvel legends team already gave us uh a, 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 a cowboy wolverine with the 80th anniversary so they're gonna give us another cowboy wolverine in the 50th anniversary really makes sense hasbro it really makes sense marvel legends team but yeah, but anyway, uh, the the Lalandra that could have been a deluxe figure also, but they can give us another Wolverine. You know, um, that Wolverine is pretty cool. Uh, you know, they they gave a little bit of articulated jaw and stuff like that. So you know, um, I'm gonna put a long game on those. Uh, I'm gonna wait on on that two pack. Um, but I definitely did order the two pack with the uh, with the saber tooth because I want I want that saber tooth. Uh, the angel figure looks real real dope. Um, uh, I have the uh, the original uh, deluxe figure of the archangel. I have that one still from when they brought it out as a deluxe. Um, I got that from Big Bad Toys back then. Um, I'm really like I really like the angel. Uh, I would like to see more of a. Uh, you know, you know, they, they said they're gonna do a more updated version of Archangel. Archangel, so I'm waiting to see that. But um, the the uh, 19 the 1997 X Men wave looking a little real promising. They giving us a more up to date look on uh, Nightcrawler. I remember uh, the Nightcrawler I got from the Marvel Legends wave. Uh, I forgot what uh, I didn't want to say it was uh, uh, what's the uh, not Caliban. What's the uh, Wendigo? I want to say it was in the Wendigo way. So it'd be looking real good to get another uh Nightcrawler to add, you know, add to the to add to the collection. So, you know, really uh anticipating that figure. I'm definitely gonna go after that figure. Uh Nightcrawler actually was one of my favorite uh X-Men in that 97 uh, movie or this 97 cartoon. Um but yeah guys, um yeah, you know, it's good to see that. You know, you know, Hasbro, man, they they funny, they funny with some of the stuff they do, man. You know, they they sit us, they 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 sit here, and they uh, they uh, they tell us stuff. You know, the new new stuff they bringing out, but literally, they know a lot of the stuff that really us, some of us collect, that really collect, you know the difference between the two. You know, just like that, uh, just like that, um, uh, uh, me and JC were talking about it uh, about a while ago when they got the uh, what is that, the new uh, the new uh. Sam Wilson figure I think is coming out if I'm not mistaken that's from the three pack you know they use that same body mold from that three pack when it came out um back then so but yeah man you know these he, he guys he, he, these guys think they're slick by pulling them trying to pull the wool over our eyes but man you know uh not a lot of stuff going on out here right now you know I see a lot of tour hunters they're going to Ross they're going to um uh, TJ Maxx, they're going to Burlington Co. Factory, some places like that. Well, my area up here, 
we don't have those uh we don't have those stores you know but you know i had saw to those ones who are getting those figures for for the low price you know um some of those guys i you know i really wasn't looking for to add to my collection you know what i'm saying but you know to each his own you know for myself i'm kind of like stepping away a little bit from the marvel legends because you know they're the only thing they're doing is giving us these repeats and re these re reused figures remolds i mean it's you know come on guys like you, you guys are you're killing me softly with that so got that water you know got to, got to wet the whistle a little bit so but yeah guys um uh, nothing really else that you know that's really coming out uh, real major yet yeah, for the new year. I'm really I'm really excited to see uh, see what they got in store for us for the for the 2024 upcoming year. Um, you know, it's starting off as a pretty promising so far. You know, with them doing that uh, the saber tooth figure, I guess I'm, I'm really excited for that one. Uh, Transformer line, uh, still waiting on uh, what I've noticed. What I've noticed. And a lot of my my targets around my area. I don't know if anybody else. Uh, I haven't seen yet the Power Master Prime in my stores. Uh, I haven't seen. Um, I seen Dinobot Snarl only one time. I seen it only one time. My local targets up here. But um, and then like uh, yeah, but then like too they got like uh, some stuff. Uh, I know that's 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 out. It hasn't hit uh, 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 Target and Walmart like the Helix. Uh, figure I've been I've been seeing her popping up in GameStop and stuff like that. So you know, got a lot of questions about that. You know, why a lot of these, these figures aren't going into uh, Target? You know, like like the uh, like the whole uh, that whole wave line, the Malice the Malice one. That whole wave wasn't sold at Target. So you know, I'm trying to figure out you know you know what's the deal with that. I don't know if it's a Disney thing or what, but but yeah, that that wave didn't show up in Target. So, uh, my purchase for you know this week, um, I really didn't do too much. Uh, I did pick up the uh, the Gotham by Nightlight Gaslight Batman. See in the picture, um, I did pick up the uh, the um, Got You Man Ken the Eagle from Storm Collectible. Oh uh, man, that figure is pretty dope. Um, I wish they would have gave him a little bit more uh, soft goods as far as like his uh, his cape and stuff. You know, instead of making it uh, a hard plastic, I wish they would have gave us like a soft goods. At least, at least run a wire in between it that way it can make it feel look like he's you know his his cape is flaring out. Um, what else did I pick up? Uh, I did get the Green Goblin. I got that. Um, uh, my uh, what else did I get this week? Um. I think that's about it. I think that's about it. That's thing. This thing is about it. That I what I picked up this week, and um, also too, I did go to uh, my local comic book store, uh, nerding out. They had a few good things, uh, and I picked up this guy right here. I was looking for him to kind of top off my my Hulk collection. Uh, I did pick up the the uh, San Diego Comic Con Incredible Hulk. Got that dude. Uh, this is the only one I'm really missing uh, as far as Hulk for my collection. Um, you know, I'm a real big Hulk fan. I love, I love the Credible Hulk, man. You know, this, this, I, I like this dude. So, but yeah, got, I got all, I got this, got this dude um, from there, uh, from that comic, from, you know, from, from my comic book store there. Real dope figure, real dope. I'm, you know, like I said, I like the Hulk. You know what I'm saying? So, but yeah, guys. Um. Let's talk about some wrestling news. Friday, right? Friday night SmackDown was real exciting. Uh, a lot, not really a lot, really going on on, on up there. Besides uh, the, the feud with the Bloodline, uh, we got uh, Randy Orton challenging um, the, the Tribal Chief, where she made his his appearance, uh, first appearance in a while. So you know. They got that going on. Roman Reigns plays the tour. Randy Orton, he didn't earn anything. He had to get in the back of the line. So, you know, Randy Orton uh, pursued her to attack him. Uh, they went, they got it got it going. Uh, but prior to that, Randy Orton and Jimmy got into it. So they had like a little match and stuff like that. And Solo Sequoia come out. 
you know, and try to help Jimmy out. But the biggest surprise of the whole night was when AJ Styles came back, man. Like when AJ came back, I was man, I was going, I was going crazy, man. AJ Styles, for some odd reason, I man, is one of my favorite uh, wrestlers, man. I, I remember AJ from back in TNA days, um, from back in um, uh, when he was uh, with WCW. And, and then he then he transitioned over to uh, to the WWE. So yeah, man, like it's a lot of good things going up over there. Um, uh, what else? What else happened on uh, on SmackDown? Man, I can't even remember, guys. You know, it's like just, just so much stuff going on right now. You know, uh, you know AJ Styles attacked LA Knight from behind. So I'm trying to I want to kind of see what that what they leading up with that. Uh, Me Chin and uh, what's uh, what's the lady? What's the girl name? Uh, uh, Selena Vega. They they fought against uh, 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 the Bu- Kabuki Warriors. That was that was that was pretty. That was a pretty decent match. Uh, kind of knew what the outcome was gonna be with that. But yeah, man, you know, uh, man, like it's it's a lot, man. You know, I, I, right now I got a, my, you know, kind of brain kind of fogged up right now. I can't remember what else happened on Friday Night SmackDown, but those, but those are the key points that really stood out to me on SmackDown. I, you know, I, I don't think everything else is well, really irrelevant. Oh, um, but yeah, yeah, oh yeah, I forgot, I forgot. They got the USA Tournament. They got Kevin Owens. He advancing. Uh, Carmelo Hayes. He 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 advanced up there. I can't wait to see my boy Trick Williams, man. They need to bring Trick Williams up to the main roster, man. They need to bring my boy up to the main roster. Um. Um, but yeah, uh, then you know, uh, then too, uh, they, you know, uh, they got some pre-orders up for some of the new wrestling figures that's coming out. Uh, I didn't get the Logan Paul uh, Ultimate figure, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna wind up getting the, the lead that's coming out for him. Uh, then also too, I heard that they got uh, new Cody Rhodes Ultimate coming out, Sami Zayn and um, and uh, uh, Kevin Owens. I heard that from. Uh, my damn toys a good channel if you guys haven't checked that channel out you into wrestling my man be on top of what's coming out i enjoy his content i enjoy listening to him uh man like dude dude this dude this dude does awesome work as far as reporting about wrestling figures that's coming out and man you know uh you know i just want to kind of like uh send a big shout out to my to my guy uh jc man like jc you know True friend, man. True friend. Good dude. Good dude. Good dude, man. My man Eric. I want to send a shout out to him. You know, we get on the phone all the time. We chop it up. We talk all the time. My man Calvin can't forget about him. You know, we all you know, you know, we all get together. We talk, you know, talk about collecting and stuff like that. You know, you know, just 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 chopping it up. But you know, I just want to send a big shout out to you, to those guys. Um, hopefully, you know, one day, you know, we get my boy JC, get him back. You know up on the tube, you know what I'm saying, bro, we miss you up here, man, you know what I'm saying, but yeah, so with that being said, guys, that's pretty much all the news I got for this week, um, I, you know, I try to do at least two, uh, two videos a week, maybe more if I can get it in, and, uh, about stuff that I'm doing, about stuff that I'm hearing, about stuff that's coming out, um, I'm really excited, uh, for the, uh, the new G.I. Joe's is coming out. It should be start dropping out next year. Um, I did finally find uh, a Crasher, which was uh, the, one of the GoBots from the um, Velocitron Wave. I got picked picked her up off of Amazon. So I'm waiting. That should be here on the 22nd. But not the 22nd, the, 20, uh, the 27th of December. My bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. So that should be here then. But all in all, guys, um, to the next chop it up happy holidays to you uh happy new year to you uh uh yeah man uh congratulations to uh mr stargell you know he man he had, uh hit 3000 you know subscribers on his channel you know what i'm saying so but yeah guys with that being said to the next chop it up session I remember toys keep them cool like the other side of Pillow Man and Hawk Smash and we out. <laughs>